Hey everyone, it's Matt Savage and you're watching the Savage Beat of the Week. This week on the Savage Beat is pretty much a highlight reel by Nick Petrangelo, the winner of the WPT World Online Championship Six Max event. But I want to start with our roller coaster hand of the week, the hand that propelled Arpsium Pro Stack to the chip lead at the final table. Chris Hunican had Ace Queen and Arpsium Pro Stack Pocket Tens, a pretty simple flip spot, except when you know that you're playing for 500,000 and a major title. When a queen hit the flop and a queen hit the turn, Huni was looking good. But on the river, a jack falls. And that gives the pocket tens a straight and artsy and pro stack, the chip lead going into the final table. In this I Love Aces hand of the week, it's the one that got Nick Petrangelo really rolling at the final table. Nick picks up aces to Elier Sion's jacks. And when an ace hit the flop and Elier couldn't improve on the turn, Nick Petrangelo wins a big pot to the dismay of the rest of the final table. And in the I hate aces hand of the week, Jack Gong, who started the day as a short stack, loves to see the aces, even more so when Nick Petrangelo moves all in with Jack-10 suited. But when the flop comes, trip jacks for Petrangelo and quad jacks on the turn, Jack Gong's aces go down in flames. Let's face it, Nick Petrangelo put on an absolute clinic that even had great players like Tony Dunst and Jamie Kerstetter scratching their head. In the hero fold of the week, Nick dumped top pair of queens to Artisum's deuces full of queens in a hand that had to have Artisum ready to cry. I know I would have. We saved the best for last in the amazing bluff of the week when Petrangelo risked his tournament life when he moved all in with just a pair of sevens on a four diamond board. Pro Stack had the jack of diamonds. He should have won, he should have been champion, but he wasn't because Nick's bluff amazingly worked and it propelled him to his first ever WPT title. Congratulations, Nick, and welcome to the Champions Club.